Hey everybody, welcome to another installment of Brad Cook Stuff. So, I'm going on vacation soon, but I needed a little something to have before I left that would taste good, but wouldn't leave a whole lot of leftovers and wouldn't be particularly difficult to make. So, while I was doing some shopping the other day, I happened upon some microwavable cheese fondue. And I thought, yeah man, cheese fondue is pretty good. The only question is, what would I dip into it? So, I grabbed a couple extra things and I think you're gonna like them. So, we're making some cheese fondue tonight in the microwave. Let's take a look at the rest of the ingredients and see what we're working with. These are tonight's ingredients. We start with some cheese fondue, which of course I got at a discount. Some baby corn, which I always love using in dishes. Some very spicy chorizo style sausages. And finally, some actual French jambon sec, which is basically a dried ham. That's what's gonna be used to wrap everything else. All right, let's go ahead and get our dipping stuff ready first. I pulled half the baby corn and three of the sausages, but I think we need to heat them up just a little bit in the microwave before they're ready to go. Next, we put this cheese fondue sauce into this little microwave container and pop it into the microwave. While we wait for that to heat up, let's go ahead and wrap this baby corn and these spicy sausages in some hambon sec. So I wrapped my sausage and baby corn in this hambon sec and cut it into pieces, and it does not look great, man. That hambon sec kind of clings to itself, but this is what I got. So let's go ahead and get it into that cheese fondue. All right, moment of truth. I have here a plate with some spicy sausage and baby corn badly wrapped in actual French hambon sec to put into this bowl of microwave cheese fondue. All right, so first of all, there we go. Get a piece of this baby corn with humble and sick. Let's dip it and eat it. Oh, look at that sucker, man. All right. Mmm. That's not bad. Seriously, I like baby corn. That stuff's pretty good. All right. Let's go ahead and try some of this spicy chorizo style sausage. All right. Oh, look at that. We got a lot of cheese on that one. There we go. All right. Let's give it a try. See how it tastes. Mmm. Mmm. That's a good bit better, I have to say. Let's try another little bit of this hambon sec wrapped baby corn. Let's get a couple of pieces. Plenty of cheese sauce. There we go. Mmm. Honestly, that's not bad. If you put it in the microwave for a little while and wrap it up in the hambon sec, the baby corn is surprisingly decent. But really, I think this sausage, I think this is the stuff that really probably tastes the best in here. And yes, it's pork and pork, but I'm not going to complain. Anyway. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right, so this was kind of a last minute whim. I saw this microwavable fondue cheese on sale and thought, what can I do with this? Made something I thought would taste good. Not quite as good as I expected, but I mean, it's still pretty good. I've never tried fondue before. So yeah, I like this, but it's definitely not among the best things I have made for the channel, for sure. Anyway, I have a fair amount of this left. A little bit left in the fridge I didn't even use, and probably most of this fondue cheese left. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish up what I got here. This is kind of a late night snack for me, but as always, appreciate you guys stopping in, and we'll see you in the next video.